All right, guys, so tell me what's going on with Hertz. This is too crazy for me, especially how this is a company that's going bankrupt. It's in debt. Its business model isn't really sustainable. And you have Uber and Lyft taking a ton of their business. It's a rental car business, and it just went up 142% today. And these guys were filing bankruptcy several months ago, and when they filed for bankruptcy, shares absolutely popped off. It's pretty crazy for some reason when a company wants to go up a little bit all they need to do is say bankruptcy, and then everyone just starts piling in. But of course, in the past month, Hertz was going down from $1.44 down to $1.02. It wasn't really looking good for the bulls, and also, it wasn't really looking good for the bears either, especially how this decline was so slow to the point that data decay really did set in. But of course, today, it went up 142%. So what is going on? One of the biggest things about Hertz is they just secured a $1.7 billion financing deal with a bunch of other big banks and hedge funds and stuff like that. And their stock more than doubled. This is really good news because they will be using at least $1 billion to fund new acquisitions and get more cars for their fleets, especially how their fleet needs a major renovation. And a billion dollars could probably get you like a few Lambos and also some Ford Fusions. And then the rest of the money will be for like corporate, also overall company restructuring. If you check this out, you clearly see a lot of money is being poured into Hertz. And so far, the lenders who signed letter committing to fund the loan, this includes Apollo Global Management right here, Diameter Capital Partners, and Silver Point Capital. So this is what's going on. Let's just see what the stock is doing because so far Hertz isn't really in a good state. But the whole reason why and the only reason why shares popped up this much is because of the financing deal. That's about it. And this financing deal should definitely keep Hertz well afloat on its boat for the next few months. If you check out the overall options chain, people made an absolute large sums of cash, like a thousand, three thousand percent. It's pretty crazy. These are kind of like lottery ticket plays, in my opinion. But so far, what's really interesting about Hertz is the deal was announced. It went up to 135 percent. It went down to 69 percent, 75 percent. And the crazy part is, generally speaking, a lot of times these kind of companies, the bad companies, usually just keep going down after the major news since everyone is simply selling profit. But a lot of people started piling in during this drop and it started going up to a peak of 158%. Absolutely crazy. So that's about it. Thanks for watching, guys. And comment below. Honestly, though, I better not be seeing you guys buying Hertz. You can if you want to, but it's a really crazy gamble. Thanks for watching.